What is going on guys? So, welcome to today's video. Today is a full day of eating as you can see by the title. And it's not just a regular full day of eating, it's kind of like a cheat day full of eating. We're, we're gonna live on edge for the day even though we're dieting, but we're gonna kind of push that to the side. We're focusing on eating good food today. However, we're still gonna track our macros and do all that good stuff. Anyway, today is not just a regular video. Today there's no fitness. It's more, yeah, this sort of vlogging, but more just eating and showing you guys what I eat. Right now, I just got back from church. As you can tell, outside, amazing, beautiful day. It's like 62, 63, and it's nice and sunny, as you can tell. Amazing, and uh, I feel like not just should you be physically in, in physical shape, like physical fitness, have that on point, but you should also have your mental fitness and your spiritual fitness on point because that's like an overall characteristic to have something good to shape yourself so as I said I just got back from church I try to get every Sunday in I just went last Sunday I didn't show you but let's let's enough of this ranting you know let's get to the good food you know what I mean so let's go inside and see what we got first snack of the day this is gonna be a pre-workout snack before we go and uh, I got some apples, sliced up apples on here. And then you probably think they look gross, but that's actually blueberry syrup on top. Check that out. They say, you know, an apple a day keeps the YouTube subscribers happy. No, 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 but no, seriously, an apple a day keeps the doctors away. Before we hit lunch, we are gonna hit a workout. We got a push workout, but too bad you guys cannot see it because this is a full day of eating video, you know? Yes, as you can see, you're rocking that Alpha Lee. Some are shredding that new shirt and the Alpha Lee hat to match it. Is that too much matching? I wonder if that's a little too much matching. But I have a trick up my sleeve for this lunch. It's not no average lunch. And uh, you're probably wondering what trick do you have and what sleeves are you talking about? I don't have, I'm not wearing any, I'm not wearing no long sleeve. If you guys. <laughs> but, um,. I have something for you guys, something super special. Well, it's special for me, not for you. So, just stay tuned and you guys will find out. All right guys, so what we got right here is this pack of lettuce. These are uh, low carb, 60 calorie uh, tortillas. I'm basically just gonna make a wrap with this Deli Fresh Honey Smoked Turkey Breast. So, just gonna make this really quick. Will be our snack. I'm gonna enjoy that as you guys just saw. This little, I have no what idea what it is. Let's just call it the taco creation, okay? Let's just call it that. Then I'm gonna wash it down with a diet cherry 7 up. And if you're one of those firm believers that diet sodas and diet drinks are gonna cause you cancer and uh, may eventually kill you, um, you keep believing that. But I'm gonna drink it because. Uh, Zero calories. Show me love, show me love, show me love. I got a crick in my neck, limp in my stick. Woo! Look where we're at, guys. Read that. I'm here to pick up an order, man. Uh, after picking up the donuts I kind of I've been thinking about this sort of long and hard and basically I'm gonna have a free day a free day of eating just to mentally stimulate me and get me on the right path because when you're dieting for so long you get like this mental block to where you think anything that you eat that's out of the ordinary is going to tremendously affect you in a negative way but lately my workouts have not been suffering so much but just being in an energy deficit calorie deficit for so long I feel like it's kind of taking its toll a little bit so I want to get a reefy day in here it's not really gonna be a reefy day I'm not gonna track anything so it's gonna be a free day and that's just gonna I'm not I'm not I do not want to feel guilty about this day so I'm just gonna have what my cravings want and then as soon as tomorrow comes 
directly back on the on the dieting you know what i mean so that's what today is going to be hopefully you guys are enjoying it so far and i know it hasn't been such so exciting but we are going to make most of it so stay tuned i try to flex the broken not really in the right mindset to see no pain what is up guys so we're currently here with amy her and her donuts just arrived here at my dorm can you see that you want to say hello to them okay let's open her up and here's amy's donuts okay Mmm. So definitely a peanut butter flavor. Then they have slices of freaking banana on top right here. Slices of banana. Then the chocolate, of course, you can taste at the very end. And then you get this smoky flavor with the bacon. Oh gosh, I should be like a travel channel enthusiast person who goes around eating. Yo guys, so I'm just here watching a little bit of uh, Back to the Future Part 3 and uh, I was just kicking back watching the movie so into it, eating the donuts, you know, I told you guys what I was going to do and then I would just like look down and the box was empty like I, I was just crushing them I, was, I had no clue Like I was like, damn, I was supposed to save them for later but it's okay, so I used reduced fat turkey sausage and then I got cilantro lime diced tomatoes you see that? And then a packet of fat-free cream cheese. Sausage is, sausage is cooking up nice and great. Okay, so now it's time for the cream cheese. It's already in there, just put it in. So when it's all said and done, you know it's right when it kind of looks like a dog's doo-doo. But if you're feeling really ballsy, get some uh, cayenne pepper to sprinkle a little bit on top for some extra spice. Here is the final result. As you can see, some chicken on top, and then you see this little side of lettuce that I have on top. You're probably thinking, why didn't you cover the other half? And um, it's because I kind of want to just taste it on its own, the way it's supposed to be tasting. I don't want to like incorporate lettuce into it because that's not the idea. But it is a fitness channel, and we do revolve around fitness. So, gotta have our greens in there, guys. Come on. Who am I kidding? I just took down a box of six donuts by myself in less than like 10 minutes watching a movie. Ah, uh, yeah, I gotta work on the fitness thing, you know. One hour later! Man, what a beautiful day in Colorado Springs. Gosh. Man, my weirdness really comes out sometimes and I just... Let me... Let, I was about to ask. Let me know if you guys, if you guys enjoy the weirdness. Because overall, I'm a weird guy, like, I just don't really show it much. And one of my friends, actually, her name is Ashley Gandhu, she watches my YouTube channels. What? A, yeah, she's my friend, her last name's the same as mine. Um, we actually had this really good conversation one time, where she told me to just be myself. She kind of notices that I'm not really myself in, on YouTube, and I kind of want to I kind of want to get to that, like, just being myself. She, I was talking to her one-on-one, -on -one. she's just like, why don't you act like this on your YouTube channel? Like the way you're talking to me right now, like this is what people would love to see, you know? And I was just like, you know what? You're completely right. You're exactly right and I feel people would enjoy the content. If it was just more about myself, I feel like I try being like other people on YouTube that I watch. That I'm aspiring to be someone else that I'm not. And that's not the way I, that's not the one way I want to be, be portrayed by others. Especially people who know me. They're watching my videos and like, why is he acting like that? He, that's not him. That's not Randy, you know? So I if I if I start being weird and doing some weird stuff, so you guys should completely understand that's the real me. Jump in, jump in, jump in, them boys are just something. Fuck that nigga that you love. A, a lemur? No, I'm not just messing with you. It's a ferret. Now that is hella gross. I would never own a rat. And even if you paid me, I will not. Never. 
Not even if there's a fire. Gas and grass? You're kidding me, man. That's crazy. There's just, I look at, speaking about cannabis shops, here's another one right here. Cannabis shop? Cannabis shop? And cannabis shop. Oh, wait. Farm Fresh confused me. Farm Fresh Produce confused me. I thought that was a cannabis shop. Because you never know when it's, they say Farm Fresh out here might be talking about cannabis anyway now i'm messing with you i came to sprouts really quick to see if they have um walden farms pancake syrup and after today i'm still craving some sweets so i'm gonna see what i'm gonna get look at all these chocolates insane might get something oh, man. i picked up a lot of candy i picked up tons of candy guys check this out this is going to be the last meal of the day, candy, who wouldn't want candy for dinner? This is my ride home, one, this is a honeycomb, chocolate covered honeycomb, so, because I'm pretty sure you guys would like to know too. Gosh, it's like a rock, it's like a rock. Mmm. 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 As my mother, I am not a honey type of guy. I do not like honey in my tea. I do not like honey in a spoon. I do not like ingesting honey in its pure form. I just don't. But this, this chocolate, look at this. Hold on. That tastes like a Twix, literally. A Twix candy bar. Oh, oh, it's a dog. Holy cow, that's a cow. I'm driving by him. I'm driving by that animal. Look at him, damn, he's massive. This is my cheat day, right? So I'm gonna go order some wings. And then I'm gonna go order a torta from a Mexican taco truck here nearby. So I'm gonna see how good this Mexican, this Mexican stuff is. Porque yo soy mexicano, ¿sí? Sabes que yo soy mexicano, hablo mucho español y yo sé que la comida mexicana es para mí. Mira, me gusta la comida mexicana. But I'm ready. I'm ready. Let's go get some food. I'm gonna take this big old staff with me. Look at this. Yeah. Let's go. <gasps> okay, guys, I guarantee you, see my truck right there? When we come back, I'm gonna move this truck, and when we come back, this spot's gonna be gone. Watch, there's more spots over there, and more spots over there, but just know this spot will be taken. Nice little setup, guys. Just ordered, and you know it's real when uh, they talk back to you in Spanish. So, for sure, authentic. Hell yeah, wing stop, baby. Guys, driving, driving on base is literally like so freaking dark. Like, look at this. What did I say? This guy took my damn parking spot. I knew it was gonna be gone. I knew it. Gosh! Yeah! Oh, I made it. Oh, gosh. I'm freaking excited for this, man. Freaking excited. Man, if you guys really... If I get over 50 thumbs up for this video, I will do the 10,000 calorie challenge. And I really want to do the 10,000 calorie challenge. So even if I don't get 50 thumbs up, I'm probably still going to do it. But look at this. Wing stop. Torta. Let me unwrap it for you guys. Yo guys, cravings are gonna be solved after today. Look at this torta right here. Let me zoom in. Oh my gosh, man, that looks freaking marvelous. Throw some chile on there, some salsa. Smells pretty good. That 
is hands down, hands down better than any burger that you could pick up from any restaurant. That was pretty damn easy because it was just so good. Like that. Crushed it and crushed that. So you guys are probably thinking, damn, you ate so much. That's a lot. I would have never done that. Are you like a vacuum? Who are you related to? Mark Henry, this and that, all these questions. And you're probably thinking, oh, you're done for the day, aren't you? No, I'm not done. I got one more thing to eat. Oops, I did it again. Bring your Britney Spears into this. So I got caramel chocolate pecan things, some gummy worms. Of uh, protein Greek 100 because we need our protein on this fitness channel. Um, roasted pecans, some watermelon, and blueberries in there. I'm gonna enjoy enjoy this last thing of the day before we head back to tracking macros all again tomorrow. Just crushing it, easy, too easy. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you do a day of eating without tracking macros. Really enjoyed it. Stuffed to the max right now. Uh, I'm gonna admit it, I'm a little stuffed, but uh, look at that. Bam, look at that pump, baby. I have a feeling I'm gonna have a great workout tomorrow. Tomorrow's leg day. And, uh, but I'm gonna end this vlog here. Hope you guys enjoyed this day of eating video. If you guys did, and if you guys really want more, comment down below. The more likes you get, the more likes I get, the more I know you liked it. So the more I can create. And um, if I get 50 plus likes, I will do the 10,000 calorie challenge somewhere in June, late June, early July. But that's gonna include today's videos, boys and girls. Hope you guys boys and girls yeah hope you guys enjoyed it if you guys did see you guys on the next one later guys and you say that